Welcome back everyone. Agoy, this is it everyone. So finally, I think mauna gid ni. So we were able to make both cameras working. So we have on the left the Nikon Z6 mounted on our Moza Air 2. And the Nikon D750 on my right mounted on a tripod. So far, early, earlier we tried uh, recording and it was lagging so terribly. <laughs> but I think it was just a uh, setting issue. So we searched on YouTube on some of the recommended settings to remove lag so hopefully this time it's gone so we tried recording a while ago another round of recording and the lag uh, is gone so right now we're again testing live streaming hopefully there is no lag and we're also testing if this uh, video mic is working so this is plugged directly on our d750 camera so i hope this is working let's try checking the checking our stream in our phone let's see okay Let's go to channel. Okay, okay. All right, it's now here. Oh. All right. Okay, I can see it's there's a bit of delay from Okay, there's a bit of delay. But I think uh, the video is not lagging anymore. Alright, alright. Alright, I think it's working. It's working. So the next thing we do is find a cover for this microphone. But because it, it's look, it looks very ugly. <clears throat> It's almost 3 a.m. So let's go to sleep. Finally, it's working. All right. Okay. And that's it. Thank you very much, YouTube and OBS. So we're using... Um, so for our setup, so we have... We're using a very cheap video capture card, HDMI. Uh, the Nikon Z6 works uh, directly without any capture capture card, video capture card, thanks to the new Nikon Webcam Utility app. So <clears throat> it it enables the camera to be working directly as a web camera. So there's no problem with that retaining all the camera features the autofocus and all the settings the d750 on the other hand still the same d750 with its limitation in terms of live view focusing so we keep the camera on manual focus but i think the picture quality looks better there is like a I don't know. The Z6 is too sharp, while the D750 is like kind of soft. So we're using the Tamron 35 on the D750, and on the Z6 we are using the Ket lens, the 2470 f/4 lens. All right. So. Is the camera working? I mean the microphone? Do we have anybody in the house right now? I think there's no one. 
Okay. So the the biggest um, so we're planning to do um, live streaming uh, services, but I guess we need to have additional USB ports for this because right now we cannot use my keyboard anymore and also we're gonna needing um, plugs for my key external keyboard but pretty much it looks like everything's working so I'm just doing some more testing to see if the lag is still there I can see there's a bit of flicker and delays but hopefully everything is okay all right let's see okay so what we need now is to complete the setup for a simple live streaming service um, is a battery adapter for both cameras and longer cables so we can distance the setup from the the camera and to our subject all right so one camera and two cameras all right this looks promising i hope okay time is 244 think it's time to sleep because no one is awake anymore and we will wake up early again tomorrow because my kids are homeschooling and I need to attend to their homeschooling also <laughs> okay I can see a bit of uh, noise from the camera picking up a lot of noises I think so we added some filters on the audio input capture so this is the nicest thing I guess with OBS studio because we can add filters like uh, noise reduction and the compressor so making our voice um, sound a little bit nice so I think the audio will improve as well if we can find um, a noise what's that noise cover for this uh, video microphone all right let's that's it everyone thank you for watching whoever you are there's one viewer can you raise your hand over there or no or it's just me anyways I'm just happy that it's looking um, good right now I've been working on this for a little while trying to find the cheapest in, uh, hardware I can find to make uh, this thing work this setup work so it's not lagging all right thank you and goodbye well if you have questions about the setup just let me know and i will be happy to help you if you're also doing the same setup thank you and goodbye don't forget